I served with a spoon of lemon cream. We'll have to let the kitchens know. And these flowers. They're just all wrong in the crown lands. And these flowers. Mirror, they're just Are you all listening to wrong me? in the crown lands. Whoops. Lady Marjorie, good tidings to you today. Thank you, Lord Tyrion. And you, Lady Mira, a word in private, if I may. I'll return her shortly. Who would I be to deny Lord Tyrion? Very soon you'll be the queen, and if you're anything like the current one, you'll deny me all you like. Oh. Please excuse me for a moment, my lady. I mm. promise I won't keep you long. I mean, she said it herself. I don't think Lady Marjorie likes me. Although, after tonight, I suspect I won't be her least favorite Lannister anymore. What did you want, my lord? Oh, there's much unpleasant business to be done today. But I bring you a bit of good news. I've arranged for the Crown to purchase Forrester Ironwood. A royal decree sits on my desk now. And I'll have my squire Podrick see to it at the first opportunity. You'll bring prosperity to your family. They're lucky to have you. You honor me, Lord Tyrion. Thank you. I know the Crown doesn't hold my family in high regard. Only you could make such a strong gesture to House Forrester. Don't think I've forgotten your side of the arrangement. As handmaiden to the new queen, you will undoubtedly prove useful. Enjoy the festivities. Goodbye. If I'm not getting kicked out by now. Today of all days, you know I didn't want you talking to him. You're playing a dangerous game, Mira. Sarah will help me with my gown and hair. But... I'll deal with you after the wedding. Oh, God. I don't know. She said that she me, can't Sarah. deny it. What the hell? Why is she looking so mad at me now? <laughs> what? Why is everybody in this game mad at me? Come on. Garrett. Easy now. Sorry. I was just keeping at the ready. That's good. Don't lose that. I understand your uncle paid you a visit. What did he want? Not many people pass through here. What brought him this far? He was just delivering ironwood shields for the Night's Watch. Good. Our stocks are running low. I know it couldn't be easy seeing him, but you have to leave all that behind. Especially now that you're a ranger. Aye. I know you had told me you could stand with these men, but not every brother's a friend. If it came to it, and you were in trouble north of the wall, any of them you'd trust by your side. You know these men. Who do you want watching your back? Finn can handle himself. I'd bring him to a fight. I'm glad you can trust your brother. I'll remember it. Errol's Holt of White Harbor, Corlys Wells from Stony Sept, and finally we've got more spawn of nobility joining us. No. Brit Warwick of House Whitehill. It can't be. Check House Whitehill. Sure this one to the Boltons. What the hell is he doing here? After that, we'll be sorting out gear. Oh, Gary. what's the master? You know him. Come on, get moving. Garrett, who is he? That man murdered my family. What? Snow. See these new recruits to the master. Don't do something you regret. I have to play the smart. I will probably it get the chance. a fucking pig farmer. I'm to here because of you. Got sent to the war for that <laughs> little party I do with your family. Don't think it's over. Best watch your back. What are you waiting for, recruit? Personal invitation from the king? Welcome to the wall, brother. Looking forward to it. That's enough. I said move. I'll be seeing you, farm boy. Oh, at least he got what he deserved. 
Ooh, it would be really funny if he got to be my friend in the end, but I don't think that will happen. <laughs> I don't know, I think I'm doing fine with him. Fine and with Asher. Okay with uh, Roderick, but pretty bad with Mira. Sure, most likely. This isn't spot. fair. We were supposed to be up there. I'll never see another wedding like this. I don't know what you did with Tyrion Lannister that made Cersei want to punish you, but it never should have affected me like this. You just don't get it, Sarah. I've been fighting for my family's lives here, and what Tyrion Lannister did for me, it may have saved them. Whether you have a seat at the wedding just isn't as important. I see. Uh, oops. Well, I hope it was worth it, because you don't know how furious Marjorie is at you. When I was getting her dressed for the wedding, she was talking about who she could replace you with. <gasps> I probably shouldn't have even told you, but I suppose you have a right to know. Oops, uh, I wanted to say it's something. how things change, isn't it? I seem to remember, not too long ago, I was asking for your help with Marjorie. Uh. And now here we are. With you on the outside needing my help. So, go on. Ask me for it. Sarah, I was wrong not to offer you my help. I can only ask you to be a better friend than I was to you. Don't worry. We'll figure this out. I'll beg Marjorie if I have to. Oh. I'm not letting her send you home. I must have been. She seems... So far, she seems to be a really true friend. Oh, they're already serving the pie. Oi. We're missing everything. I know you. You were in the gardens the other night with Damien. Before he disappeared. I have a few questions to ask you. What were you doing there with him? Mira? Don't think I don't know it was you. You've made a mistake. No. Seven hells. You there, girl. I need a towel or a wet cloth, something. Lord Morgren. You'll need to find someone else. I'm not finished Are with her. you sick, man? Do you think I have time to bother with handmaidens? Release her or I'll have Queen Cersei find you another job. Too bad. I think the next time I will trust her. If she she actually seems to help me. Well, I just ruined a perfectly good shirt to come to your rescue. No need to explain what that was all about. That was kind of you. I do appreciate it. Well, I didn't do it merely for your benefit. Then why? Perhaps I recognize a kindred spirit. It's not every little handmaiden who can steal an ironwood decree with the crown right out from under my nose. Consider me impressed. My partners, I am afraid to say, felt rather differently about it. You flatter me, my lord. <laughs> I'm only saying you have potential, my lady. Oh, sh Your is he, isn't is he one of the white hills? You still think like a handmaiden. Do you even understand why Tyrion gave you the ironwood deal? Because it wasn't out of the kindness of his heart. I'm no fool. He wants something from me. Access to Marjorie. Or perhaps he just knew he could get the cheapest iron. From me. Very observant. <laughs> you are no mere handmaid. I remember what it was like to be new to this game. You feel like you're drowning, don't you? Oh, yes. But there's no one you can really trust. What you need more than anything is an ally. I could be that for you, Lady Mira. Is that something you'd be interested in? And what exactly are the terms of this offer? What do you get out of it? A smart question. <laughs> so, let me be blunt. Circumstances have put us at odds. But what if we were to work together? Control the price of Ironwood together? We could get very, very rich together. 
Or should I go back to Lud Whitehill? Who has proven to be very interested in it? Oh god. Oh, I forgot that being with Tyrion at this point isn't the smartest decision. Seeing what comes next. Um, oops. Oh, now they will think I am into this. I'm afraid it just became a very bad time to be linked to Tyrion Lannister. Oh, God. Tell me that you got that Ironwood decree from him before the wedding. Oh, no. He said it was waiting for me on his desk. <sighs> what a shame. Such potential. I'm afraid any chance of our alliance has become quite impossible. Great! You understand, Lady Mira. A paper like that will land you in the black cells. But if it were to disappear, perhaps we could talk again. Do I want to get rich? You have a good head for business, Lady Mira. It'd be terribly disappointing to see it on the end of a pike. Make it even more obvious. Damn it! Oh. Well, what do you expect? <gasps> Tom! What in seven hells do you think you're doing up here? What are you thinking? You've got to leave. Now. You don't know how dangerous this is. What's wrong with you? You can't keep sneaking after me. I'm here to help you, Mira. You know Oops. that. Oh, I miss... I'm not here for my own pleasure. It's my job. Oh, fine. Then do your job and find me a way through this door. Mira, I would be here anyway. But I can't afford not to help you. So what do we do? <sighs> I have an idea. The terrace. The what? I could maybe climb across the roof and drop down onto the outside terrace. It's just... I don't know where. Is whatever's in there really worth risking my life for? It's not just kings who die stupidly round here. No. It's not worth your life. Thank you for saying that. I guess I better not die then. Wait I don't need to, need to get rich. I'll be at the door before you know it. Oh, you're still doing it. What the hell? Uh-oh. Just what do you think you're doing here? You shouldn't be anywhere near this place. Don't you know the imp has murdered the king? I work for Lady Marjorie. Queen Marjorie. She asked me to wait here. Somehow I find that hard to believe. I'm not going to ask you again. Oi! Whoever's in there, I command you to open this door at once, in the name of the king! You, don't move. Um. Tom, it's me, hurry! Gods, that was close. I almost didn't make it back down here. Some tiles on the roof came loose. Thank you, Tom. I could never have done this without you. I'm looking for a piece of paper. A royal decree. Well, go on. That Lannister guard could be back with help any second. I'll keep watch outside the door. Tom! You can do this. Mm. <laughs> look at desk. He said it's on the desk. Might as well look on the desk. He said that it would be on his desk. Open. Not in there. Faster. Open. Tyrion strongbox. Oh, it must be in here. I think the Lannister guard is back. No, no, it's the other one. Damn it! Hide. 
I find a way to distract them. Where do I hide? Uh, duh. I'm telling you, I heard someone in here. Search the place. We'll find them. And after. Now that we've got the imp's keys, we can have a little look inside his lockboxes, eh? <laughs> Aye. Uh oh. That little guy called Thomas a really big help. <laughs> you did it. How? I lit a tapestry on fire down the hall. I bought you a minute, maybe two. Oh, thank you. Did you find it? Oh, I think I think it has to be in here. It has to be. Oh. Come on. No, 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 no. Just hurry. How am I supposed to know which keys work? It worked! Is this? Oh, thank the gods! Oh, I found it! Finally! Let's go! <coughs> I catch the bastard who... Oh, bring their bloody neck! Ooh! Uh, let's see if I can stay in Marjorie's. Uh, as a handmaiden for Marjorie. I we think that would be a, a hard decision to make. Gwyn Whitehill may already be there. What is this? Our ironwood trees. It's the Whitehills. You see what they've done? This track was hundreds of years old. Before this is done, we'll make them pay. Every last one of them. I, the White Hills, need to answer for this. And Gwyn needs to answer for this. But we need to find out what she knows. She'll be over there. Be cautious, my lord. If she go around her father to help us, she must have some purpose. I'll hear what she has to say, but I won't forget who she is. Good. You see what our family's done here. <laughs> I saw that. So I don't know how to deal with it, Wood. Here. You might want this. You may oh, have yeah. known each other since you were children, but this could be a trap. Mm -hmm. Although she might I be thinking it. the same thing. Keep it. Go on. I'll stay with the horses. If I take it and it's not a trap. She will get mad at not trusting her, and that could definitely fall in tree. Oh, what are th what have I done here? What the hell? It's not enough to take our wood. It must defile our homes. Walk. I can't. Oh, I <laughs> because there was something in the well. The way. What is this? Grindstone. White Hill wagon. Split beams, cracked wheels, shoddy workmanship. Clearly white hill. Okay. Let's see if we can slowly but surely... Oh, nice eggs. Look at this eggs first. Maybe I can... I'm pretty sure I can't, but maybe... That triggers some kind of event. Forgive oh, me. I, I wasn't sure what I'd find out here. Hello, Gwyn. Roderick, you saw my father's work over there, didn't you? There's no way to miss it. And he won't stop. He means to do that to every inch of your land. Damn your father. He's laid waste to this land. My land. I'll have my vengeance for this. I brought you here so that you would see what's happening. So there's no need to make threats against my father. That's true. I come as a friend. Do you? Yes, I do. <sighs> okay, can't fuck this up. I wasn't sure you were even going to show. Of course. 
We're taking a risk, meeting like this. Thank you for paying respects to my father and brother. And for coming tonight. It's good to see you again. And you too, Roderick. I think we can help each other. But first, I... I've heard news of Asher. That he plans to return to Ironrath. Why is he coming back? I loved him once. I longed for Asher to come back. But not like this. If you must know, he's bringing us an army. You may think that's going to help your family. But it will only lead to more killing. I want peace between our families. No more wars. No more bloodshed. Is that what you want too? Yeah. I actually I need I to want hear this. you say it, Roderick. Yes. Peace means my family will be safe. That's true. Of course that's what I want. The years have blessed you with wisdom, Roderick. And it is good you have it. Because peace is the only hope your family has. My father is just waiting for an excuse to attack. Why do you think he sent my brother? So there will be trouble. My father will bring utter ruin on your house. Unless... You let Griff feel like he's in control. I, will I know have you to refuse to kiss my father's ring. But... You would be wise to show more. That's what I said earlier. Life. I'll put on a good face and let him think whatever he likes, if that's what I have to do. It is. My lord, a band of riders approach from the north. Seven hells. My father's guards must be tracking me. If they catch us here, they'll kill you. Then we've no time to waste. Let's get on with it. My father is planning to make a move against your family. Oh no. I don't know all the details, but he's been sending a great deal of gold to someone in King's Landing. I fear for your family, Roderick. You may think you've nothing more to lose. He is ready to show you otherwise. What the hell is your father planning? I swear I don't know. But whatever it is, he knows all your weaknesses. All your plans. What? How? What is because you have a traitor in your council. Someone who knows ah! every detail of your circumstances. My father boasts of it. You must tell me. Who is it? I don't know. We know you're planning to rescue Ryan. Even if it means abandoning your home to Griff. What? My father's guards are close. I need to know you'll do what I've asked. Promise me you'll submit to Griff. I if will you have to. between our families. It's the only way. You have my word, Gwyn. I'll do my part. I mean, it's the only thing I can Thank do, especially you. if we have a traitor. We can't do any plans to attack them. My lord, those riders are nearly upon us. We have to go. What I told you. Be careful what you do with it. And remember, I'll hear about it if you don't. I don't know. I lord? don't think it's Duncan. I don't think it's like the sword master Come either. Come on, Duncan. But it would make up for a good deal, definitely. Hey guys, who would have expected that we have a traitor in our council? I at least didn't expect it at all. Who do you think is a traitor? Just comment it below in the comments. And as usual, to see the next episode, click the next episode button. And until then, see ya next time!